Sean and Amy, good morning and happy snow day on this beautiful Saturday here in Salem and all across New Hampshire. We are fired up. This is our first live shot of the day here in Salem. First of many, I'm sure. You know, I've been watching all morning and I heard Ray Brewer. He's got five layers on. That is awesome. Uh, I took his advice on getting the layers on today. I'm wearing four. Uh, I don't have to contend with the conditions that Ray is on the seacoast, but nonetheless, you just saw that wind gust come across. It certainly is windy here in Salem and it's cold. I mean, it's snowing, we know that, but I think it's that cold that really kind of is a little bit biting and uncomfortable. Uh, where I'm standing right now, in my opinion, I think this is the busiest intersection in Salem. Uh, this is Route 28 and um, the road that you take to get onto 93 exit one is just up the road from us. So on a Saturday, typically this is where a lot of people are, right? People coming up from Massachusetts and people doing a lot of shopping. Tuscan Village is right nearby, Home Depot right down the road. Uh, there's just a lot of shopping in this part of town. And as you can see, not a lot of cars out on the road. There are a couple, um, but I think most people have been heeding the advice of safety officials to stay home during this storm, certainly at this point. Um, when I left my house this morning, I, I live in Salem myself, and it wasn't too bad when I left, right? There wasn't a whole lot of snow accumulating, but it really has started to pick up um, just within the last hour or so, as our meteorologists have said. So uh, conditions are certainly picking up. The wind is picking up, the snow is too. Let's have some fun today. We're 45 in Salem. I'm Mike Cronin, WMUR News 9. And, and Mike, it looks like, uh, I know the plow trucks are out there, but it looks like it's starting to pile up down there as well on the ground. Definitely, no doubt. The plow trucks are out. I've seen a lot of them coming through. They've been coming in a line, uh, kind of working as a team to clear Route 28, which of course is one of the busiest sections um, in Salem. But you can just notice that more snow is picking up on the ground um, as we get further and further along in this storm. And that's only going to worsen, right, as the conditions um, deteriorate and the snowfall rate, you know, talking about one, two, maybe three inches an hour. So, yeah, next few hours, just stay home. Watch us, enjoy yourself, have some hot <laughs> chocolate, stay warm by the fire, and uh, enjoy the snow day, right? Absolutely. Mike, I wonder, um, in terms of your travel to your live location in Salem, like, was the snow sticking to your windshield wipers? What, what was the driving visibility conditions like? Oh, sure. Yeah. You know, I cleared my car before I left this morning, um, but the snow's falling down and it's it's sticking to the car. The windshield wipers, I mean, mine, to be honest with you, I got to replace mine. That's something that I should have done ahead of time. I guess I didn't listen to my own advice talking about preparing for this storm. Um, so it's fine right now, right? I got the defroster going, so that certainly helps. Um, but you just notice that the condition of the snow, it, it just is kind of picking up a little bit in the last hour or so. So, sure. you know, I'll keep warm in the car and uh, have some fun along the way. All right. Uh, Mike, thank you very much. Stay warm out there at Salem. Amy reminding him to get some new wiper blades. Apparently. apparently. We'll see you soon, Mike Cronin.